Hey, what's going on, guys? It's me, Fortman, and welcome to another tutorial video. This video is going to cover how you install your downloaded Rigs of Rods or BMG Drive vehicles. Now, let's just get right into it. Now, the first thing you're going to need to go is navigate to your downloads folder, which is which could be local disk, users, your name, downloads, or if you go to this PC as I'm on Windows 8 and click on downloads, it'll take you to the same thing. Now to find now once you have found your downloaded vehicle and let's see if I can find one that I that I've downloaded. Oh here's one, the Kata. This one's a Rigs of Rods vehicle. Now the way you install this is pretty simple. Basically, you navigate to your documents folder, which is which can be this PC documents, and and you know, look around until you find either Rigs of Rod 0.4 or Rigs of Rod 0.38, depending on what version you have installed. Now, double click on that. You'll come into these folders right here. The one you gotta pay attention to if you're downloading a vehicle and installing a vehicle is the vehicles folder. This is where all of your vehicles will go after they're installed. Now, remember when I told you to keep the, um, I don't think I told you this, you need to keep this downloads folder available to you as you're going to need to come back to this. Now, if you, if you like these, if you like to, if you like to install a lot of mods, if this is your first vehicle you're installing for Rigs of Rods, uh, installing it's pretty simple. You just drag the zip file over to your vehicles folder and it'll bring it over to your rigs of rods folder now if we can find all right let's just search it crown all right how about ford let's f find yeah here we go right here now this this vehicle right here is a beamng drive vehicle now it's not that different how you install it. Again, go to Documents, find your BeamNG folder. This one's a little different, even though Vehicles is pretty much right here. Uh, if you if you have used an older version of BeamNG and all your mods are gone, I'm just going to put this out here. If all your mods are gone and you're on a new version of BeamNG, uh, just don't freak because your mods didn't get deleted from the game itself. They're actually hidden in a backup folder which has all your vehicles here. As you guys can see, all my vehicles are here. And uh, let's get back to the actual tutorial. Now, once you've navigated to your vehicles folder, as you guys can see, I don't have very many vehicles, so some of them are built into the game. You were moved. Okay, never mind that. But once you've figured this out, the um, download, the installation for BeamNG is a little bit more complicated, you might say. Now, wh what we're going to do to make it a bit easier on us is we're just going to drag the Ford Crown Victoria file over to the BeamNG folder. Now, since this is a zip file, as you guys can see, the other files are regular old file folders. And the, if, if you just keep the zip file here like you usually would with a Rigs of Rods mod, that's not going to work. Because what you need to do here is you're going to need to open it with a, seven, with a zip opener program. Preferably 7-zip or WinRAR. Once you open that, you will get this screen which shows you all the folders that are in the archive you gotta pay attention to vehicles here because this is where your this is where your vehicle is packed into now when you open it you'll find a folder that looks like this some zips have multiple folders we're just gonna open this to make sure there isn't an, an extra folder alright there's not a, an extra folder but these are all the parts that come with the vehicle itself now Remember when I told you to keep this thing open? Well, what you're going to do... You were kicked from the server. What you're going to do is... You're going to take your file and extract it. 
for if you have your zip in your downloads folder, in your vehicles folder, I mean, it, you'll be able to extract it right to the vehicles itself. And once you do that, bang, right there, you got your Ford Crown Victoria sitting right here. Now, preferably, there are mods here, but I think these are for terrains or levels. Yeah, some of these are built into the game itself. So, if you're wanting to download a vehicle, you put it here. If you're going to download a terrain, you're going to put it right here. Now, that's pretty much going to do it with, for the tutorials for the night. And guys, before I end this video off, I do want to let you know, there is approximately less than 12 hours until the Forza Horizon 2 presents Fast and Furious Mega Stream begins. I hope you all are going to be there because I'm going to be live streaming for the for the entire length of Friday. If you guys enjoyed this video, a like would be greatly appreciated. And as always, subscribe for more tutorials related to Beam and G, Rigged Rods, Minecraft, whatever, whatever game you want. And I have here on my Steam library. Let me just pull it up. Any one of these games you see right here I'm on the tutorial on, I will do it for you. So guys, I will see you all next time for another tutorial video or gameplay video. Thanks for watching.